What inspires my work first and foremost is landscape. The landscape in general is hugely profound and even here the color of the landscape and the scale of it just immediately comes into my work when I'm in a new place. My name is Elizabeth Condon and I'm a 2022 artist resident at the Sam and Adele Golden Foundation for the Arts. So typically I have linen canvases and paper and I lay them on the floor or on tables and I pour. I use high flow, I impregnate it with calligraphy ink because the resin makes it react strangely and interestingly and it affects the color. And then I work on multiple substrates at once and then as they dry, start to read the tea leaves and derive images from them. So I wanna share my first lattice in the tar gel. This was completely liberating to me to see how the paint dissolved on the form. And the fact that I could make a substrate and paint into it at the same time and the painting in the substrate would make itself, it's very exciting. I'm really excited about this tar gel and I'm really excited about the gloss medium and what it can do to the marks, like in this one, that these marks just slid on like ice skating. And see, before I'd been pouring high flow into the canvas and then putting another color inside of that pool, but there's so many more options with these gels and that's pretty cool. Oh my God, cobalt green. Cobalt green is the greatest discovery I've made here, not only in the QOR, but also in a custom product, like a heavy body, super nice. So the green is just incredible and I'm in love with it. And also coarse and fine pumice blended together here and then a pearlescent on top. So that is just deeply illuminating to me and something that I've really gotten out of the residency. So I made this big, beautiful, opaque pour and then started pouring on top of that and just drawing with pouring. And the thing about the residency and having such lavish use of materials, it's like, hey, I'm just gonna open this can and pour it out on this painting. That is so exciting because at home it's more caution. So I really went for it. My name is Marcelo Pope and I am a 2022 artist resident at the Sam and Adele Golden Foundation for the Arts. I've started a, a jazz series where I am really looking at the artists that I love. Miles Davis and John Coltrane, these different artists. I'm wondering how can I reimagine through my style of work their sound. For example, this is Art Blakey and think about his song Moaning. And he was a drummer. So how do I create the spacing? How do I create sound into color and also texture? And how do I interpret their compositions that they had musically and make it into something that is a visual composition within itself? I think being here at the residency and working with different gels and mediums, you know, I've revisited fiber paste. I could use fiber paste with crackle paste. <laughs> and the idea of just crackle, that the, the name itself creates a sound. So this, this idea that I can apply something that will break and then apply another medium over it to smooth it out. A reflection of jazz music itself, this improvisation of, you know, what's going on as far as instruments in a dialogue some new things as far as my work is concerned that scale as well as collage so i've just cut out actual canvas and applied it to the canvas i'm constantly thinking of compositions as far as juxtapositions you know gloss compared to matte something that is textured compared to something that is smooth and glossy this particular piece speaks to hip-hop the golden age of boom bap this particular piece is uh, inspired by Youssef, and Youssef Latif created a song, the love theme for Spartacus. What I decided to do was carve into the paint with a screw uh, to create these little bitty lines. And in this particular space here, 
there's an undertone of paint that creates a, a wave. Uh, and so I also think of the, the painting underneath what you see because it's uh, gonna create saturation. Uh, it creates the richness um, by revealing what's underneath. New Berlin is a, a place that is special in the sense that it's so peaceful. It's lush, especially during this time. There's just synergy. You, you're welcomed in by this amazing family that can cook. <laughs> Great dinners. It's just an energy that is it's just magical. My name is Wen Meng Yu. I What I do is I arrange and organize these objects together in my works. So it's uh, some from daily life and uh, some from landscapes together. So you can see in my works because of the color, it's so different with these sceneries. It's sometimes like collage on the canvas, and uh, sometimes it's just about the texture with mediums or with pants. I combine different landscapes together. It's not just only from one picture or one photo. It's like a combination. It's about a lot of things. I how to use these tours, how to use these materials, and uh, this experience uh, lets me to think about more about my works. I use a lot of tape to do these works, and uh, it's more about objects and daily life. Yeah, so just sound from landscape, but more about lights and windows and doors, furniture. It's like the uh, atmosphere of daily life. I think the technique workshop helped me understand materials deeply. And uh, when I start to use clear leveling gel and uh, mix with my brush stroke, it's really good on the canvas. I think there are lots of products we don't have in Taiwan. So I start to, to use uh, different products like glass bead gel and uh, I got a good effects on the surface. So I love this texture. Modern past glass bead gel and the top gel and uh, clear leveling gel I never used before and I uh, I started to use here and I get more inspiration from these projects. I was so impressed by all the technicians because they are really nice and uh, really skillful. I can stay in the perfect studio. It's a good memory for me. It is an unforgettable experience to live here with our artists, Elizabeth and Marcel, both of them are lovely and friendly. And uh, I think the Golden Team takes care of us so much. <laughs>